Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 14 in chapter 7. In this chapter, we will discuss something about the work and energy. So for this problem, we can see we have a box. It sits on the floor, right? And then, this, uh, what does that mean? It tells you a force. This force is just a gravity, right? And then, ask you how much work it required to move it at a constant speed. This one, constant speed means the acceleration is zero. So every time when you do the physical problems, you need to pay attention to this word, like constant speed, acceleration is zero. And then, first one, it tell you this moves four meters along the floor uh, against a drag force. So in this one, how can we do that? First one, we can see this box on the floor. So it must be gravity, normal force. It balanced in the vertical direction, no power. Then we look at the horizontal direction. We have the force acted by the person, right? And also the force by the drag force. The drag force is given. So this is drag. Drag force by the drag. Now in this one, we can see because it moves at a constant speed. So in the X component, the acceleration is zero. The force is balanced. So we have the force acted by the person, right? So the force acted by the person and minus the drag force equals zero. So in this one, we get the force by the person, 230 Newton. The next one, the displacement is given. We can say F and it, this is D and F pointing forward. Angle is zero, right? So Fp d cosine zero degree, so we get Fp times d. In this one, you can see Fp is given, d is given. Very easily, you can get the work by the person. The next one, this time, we move the box up, so it moves vertically. When it moves vertically, very easily, we can see, and the vertically, the force is balanced. So Fp minus gravity equals zero. In this way, we get the Fp. The also, the displacement is also up. This is 4 meter, and the angle theta between the displacement and the force is 0. So we still get Fp times d cosine 0, and Fp is mg. So in this one, you input the numbers in, inside, you can get the final answer. Thank you.